What's up, what's up, collective? I hope you guys are doing good and having a beautiful, peaceful day today. Um, Your enemies are scrambling right now. They don't know what to do. Your enemies are scrambling. They don't know what to do, collective. When I say they don't know what to do, your enemies, they, you, don't, you, don't, you, you can't phantom what the fuck your enemies are thinking right now. You can't phantom what your enemies are thinking right now. The star. This could be a relationship that's going on for you right now. The empress. You could be in a relationship. You could have a new work opportunity. A new career opportunity. A new career venture that has come up. Something involving a, the star. Maybe you are the star. But that, I, I, when I say the star, I mean like a celebrity, like a high class individual. So I don't know if you're getting some sort of public public recognition. Whatever it is that you do. And I'm also getting that um, you possibly don't even know that this are high class individuals that you're helping. Whatever it is that you do or that you're doing. Nine of staff. I'm getting that whatever you um whatever you have going on right now, it's making your enemies feel like um they're going through a tower moment, like there's some sort of negativity that's taking place upon them. Like things are falling apart for them collective as things get better for you. But all this is is divine intervention. Everything happens at perfect timing. I'm getting that these enemies could have also ruined your reputation. Like they could have put your name out there real bad. Had others thinking of you bad. Talking about you badly. Had people with a negative assumption of who you are. A built up persona of who you are. And that's not, you know, who you are. What these individuals made it seem like you are. Yeah. Ten of Swords. They made it seem like you were something that you wasn't at a rapid speed. They did this quickly. They did this quickly. Look, took in things from you behind your back. If you was in a relationship, male or female, this person could have uh did something to dominate the failure of your relationship, to make a domino effect of your relationship. Somebody, um, Said something or did something to make your person skeptical about you. The world. Nine of swords. Everything is being handed to you right now in life. Everything is being handed to you definitely. Definitely. Your enemies, they're scrambling. They don't know what the fuck to do. And here's the thing. They don't know what they was they going to do because you were their plan. I say that at 333. You were their plan. You were their stability collective. You were the game plan. You was the goal. You were the you were the energy ball. You were the energy source. Page of Swords, yeah. You were the energy source. They were accomplishing off of your failures. That's what I just heard. They were accomplishing off of your failures. Damn, they could be also in isolation. They're starting the stages of isolation. They're starting the stages of isolation. They're having to go through um, losing people right now in life. They're not seeing eye to eye with friends. They're not having great co-parenting skills right now, work skills. Their communication is not very great right now because it's a lot of emotions that they're trying to keep bottled in. And I'm also getting that this person keep trying to keep bottled in their feelings 
about you because you were supposed to be failing. You were not supposed to be accomplishing anything. You were supposed to be failing your life. You were not supposed to be divine as you are. You said everything left for them. I just heard everything went left. Dead. One of your enemies could have died or is about to pass away. Then fucked around and dabbled off into the wrong sort of witchcraft or some shit. The wrong deity offered you to the wrong deity or some shit like that and it didn't work out. And then in return, they have to face death. Reduces to four. The number four is about control and organizations. Scorpio and water. Yeah. We got Queen of Swords and Seven of Swords. Unbiased judgment, independent, clear boundaries, direct communication, clear minded perspective. Yeah. And this, um, these enemies, you could possibly not even know that some of these people are your enemies. They can be acting like they're your friend. These individuals are not your friend. These individuals are your enemies. These people do not care about you. These people are using you. Upside down, King of Cups. Cold, bad advice, like I just said, these people are using you. This is not your friends, this is your enemies. But I'm getting that these individuals associate with you, talk to you, um, act like they, they, they fuck with you, and they don't really fuck with you. They don't really fuck with you. Moodiness, emotional manipulation, self-compassion, inner feelings. Yeah. <coughs> Y'all know me. Stay smoking on that gas. Knight of Pentacles. Hard work. Look, hey, I, I, I can't make none of this up. <clears throat> they wasn't that you was you was not supposed to be nowhere. Your energy was being consumed by these individuals, by this in, like several sources. This is several sources. This is several sources. Conservation, efficiency, responsibility. Aries, Taurus, air, earth. Ace of Swords, Mental Clarity, Breakthroughs, New Ideas, Success, Sharp Mind, New Conflict, Surgery. Someone could have also had a surgery, bodicular surgery, maybe a BBL, a breast reduction, <clears throat> a breast um, inducing. Like I said, public recognition. Victory, progress, self-confidence. They upset. Your enemies like that. They, they they scrambling. They don't know what the fuck to do right now. Your and when I say they don't know what to do, they don't know what to do. They know if they do any more magic on you, it's not gonna turn out well. Like it's not gonna work out. They know not to do that because they're, they're living through the punishment of that. So they're stuck at what to do now. That's why I said be careful because this could turn into physically harm you. These individuals could try to physically harm you. Because the uh, the dark magic forces and sources isn't working. Eight of Cups, familiarity, happy memories, reminiscing, childhood memories, innocence, joy. So, the, you can have a lot of memories with these enemies. Childhood friends and shit, people that you grew up with. 
upside down the world seeking personal closure shortcuts delays no closure incompletion their lives are incomplete they feel incomplete your enemies don't know what to do i think they want to come and they want to apologize to you collective look queen of pentacles fruit of labors rewards luxury self-sufficiency financial independency strength compassion completion optimism suffering second deacon virgo yeah this individual they um and i said this individual if this is one individual like they want to come and talk to you they want to be your friend they want to come communicate with you They want to get to know you. The new you. Because they know the old you. You got to be careful too. Because this could be new enemies that are approached. Like new friends. New friends, new people. People could be sent right now as well. King of Pentacles. Wealth. Business. Leadership. Security. Discipline. Abundance. Prosperity. Generosity. Yeah. Like I said, your enemies are upset as shit right now. Releasing limiting beliefs, exploring dark thoughts, the attachment, freedom, restoring control, resentment, lack of will. Like I said, they don't know what to do now. They don't know what to do now because they thought you were going to be in bondage, but they're the one that's in bondage. Negative thoughts, self-imposed restriction, imprisonment, victim mentality, entrapment. Yeah. They entrap their own mind. They put themselves in this own entrapment that they can't get out by coming up against you, by fucking with you, by touching the anointing. And I'm getting whatever they did almost fucking worked on you, baby. It almost worked on you, child. It almost took you out. Look, anxiety, worry, fear, depression, nightmares, insomnia, hopelessness, trauma, despair. Look, we got the tower again from a whole different day. We got a tower again from a whole different day. Sudden change, upheaval, chaos, re revelation, disaster, awakening, release, sudden insight. Yeah, sudden insight. These individuals are now knowing that they came up against the wrong motherfucker, that they did some shit to the wrong person. 16 reduces to 7, which is about change and options. Mars. Strength, compassion, completion, optimism, suffering. Gemini. One of these enemies could be a Gemini. Your biggest enemy, your biggest hater is a Gemini. <clears throat> Seven of Cups, Scorpio, opportunities, wishful thinking, choices, illusions, searching for purpose, daydreaming. So these individuals also can be daydreaming that they're living your life, the day in your life type shit. Regret, failure, disappointment, presumptions, loss, grief. Yeah. They, they're really losing right now, grieving right now from the loss of your energy. They don't have your energy no more, collective. So it's like, it's not really this person, there's nothing these, these individuals, this person can do. Delays, lack of motivation, lack of energy, to lack of position, weighed down, boredom. Like I said, they feel weighed down. I said that shit. I said they feel weighed down. I said that shit. This person feels weighed down, like for real, for real. They don't know what to do. Your enemies don't know what to do. They scrambling the fuck up right now. They don't know what to do. They're trying to keep everything together. They want to come and apologize to you. They want to come and tell you what they did to you and why they did it to you so that they can uh, they can be free from the burden and the curse of it. But as long as they keep it closed and not tell what they did to you, they're going to be going through it. That's what I just heard. These friends are going to be going through it. These enemies, they're going to be going through it until... They come forward, they come clean about what they've done to you, what they tried to do to you. Cause I'm getting that this is some this is some large shit that they tried to do. Worked hard. Look, worked hard. This is some large shit. This could even be some large ass sorcery or witchcraft or some shit. I don't know, but your enemies upside down, page of swords. 
deception, manipulation, all talk, hesitate, self-expression. We got upside down justice. And then we got ten of pentacles reversed. Dark side of wealth. Huh? <sighs> going through it, like I said, they're going through the dark side of wealth. Financial failure, a loss, fleeting success, lack of stability, lack of resources. They don't even have lack of, they don't even have resources. They have lack of resources. They don't have enough resources to accommodate them on the daily needs. Then we got justice, unfairness, lack of accountability, guilt, dishonesty. Yeah, they don't want to take accountability. They don't want to take accountability. Your enemies do not want to take accountability. They don't want to take accountability. We're going to put a full more here. We got the higher priest. You know exactly who your enemies are, too. Even if the, the, you still call them your friend, even if they still act like they're friends, you know exactly who they are. Higher priest, intuition, sacred knowledge, the subconscious, divine feminist, trust yourself. Sensitivities, purity, high moral. Someone could also have trust issues too. Because I was about to say trust issues. I was about to say trust issues. The beginning of the projects of creative and editors. So right now things are turning out well for you collectively. Your enemies are pissed off about that shit. They are upset. They are pissed off about that shit. Teamwork, collaboration, learning, implementation, building something. So your enemies are working together at this point. Whether this is over a lover or some shit. So if this is a lover, all this your all of your person's exes are gathering up together to gang up on you, collective. Releasing baggage, moving on, yeah. So y'all stay prayed up and y'all stay safe out here, okay? Make sure they're not getting one up on you and shit like that. Your enemies. Make sure you're not posting your business on social media for your enemy to see. Let's get in our yes or no, Holy Spirit, yes or no. Y'all go ahead and get a reading. Book a reading with me, y'all. Get a reading. I should be on live right now. Get a reading from me. I got a special going. Get a reading from me. Book a reading. Get a reading. We got there's something better. And then if you believe, yes. If you believe, yes. Take action. Look for a sign. All right, collective. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure y'all tip me because I really do appreciate it. Um, I know I'm zealing day where I guess um somebody was trying to zeal me without my permission, so it, it declined. So now zeal is open to you guys. I guess it's my phone number. Y'all stay prayed up. Y'all stay peaceful. Y'all stay consistent and prosperous. And thank you guys again for all the support. I really, really, really do appreciate it. For real, for real.